Hello everyone and welcome to episode 1 of Daily Stand Up. My goal with the series is to just create a chill dev vlog that we do every single day and I thought we could start by creating a website that can do everything that we can just incrementally add features to. One thing I wanted to make sure this time was to deploy the website I'm working on so people can actually go and visit the website and see the changes and mess around with it and all of that sort of stuff. So because we wanted to deploy it this time we obviously need a domain name so I was using this website called Namelix which generates domain names for you um, but in the end I didn't actually go for any of these. And the main reason for that really was that whenever I actually found a domain I liked it wasn't actually readily available like maybe it was for sale or something but it was never just like, oh, you can buy this for $13 or pounds or whatever you're using. I ended up just buying a domain name called Total Website, which I thought adequately described what we're building. Before creating our new repository, I actually had a bunch of old repositories that I wanted to delete, so I spent a bit of time uh, that morning when I was doing this getting rid of those. After that, I just created our new repository that we're going to be working from by just following the steps you get on GitHub. So we've got a domain name, we've set up our Git repository, and now we need to start building some features. So I thought we would try ChatGPT to see if we can get any inspiration. Initially I just asked for some sort of generic features, which obviously gave back some generic answers that were a bit vague and a bit big, you know, like user authentication, or like e-commerce, or a dashboard. That's not really what I'm looking for in the series, I sort of want to implement specific, smaller features. I wasn't really happy with the initial response, this was probably due to my bad initial prompt so I changed it to say I want specific small features that you might see on a Jira board. I thought this might give us some better actual tickets that we can work on and implement. For now I still wasn't quite happy with the responses there so I tried a third time and just asked for some like specific niche features that we could add um, but ultimately it didn't come to anything so I tried to get some inspiration from elsewhere. I really wasn't sure what feature to implement first and I guess ultimately it doesn't really matter because we're just going to be building everything anyway. Um, but then I remembered I found this website the other day which is like front end challenges and I decided to check that out, I think it was called front end Monit uh, mentor and I just saw the hangman game first and thought well maybe we can make that our first feature. So yeah that's what we're going to do but I'll probably fully implement it in the next video. I figured that for now it would make sense to create another markdown document where we can sort of write the features that we want to create, uh, but I think eventually it would be nice to actually move that onto the website since we're going to put everything on the website. Uh, so yeah, there's a few things I wanted to note down like navigation, uh, and then I wanted a search navigation because obviously there's going to be lots of things, you don't want like a huge crazy uh, graphical user interface for fine things, it would be nice if you could like search stuff. Um, so like there I put like play hangman and yeah we'll create a hangman game and we probably need like a table of contents as well or something. Uh, the last thing I actually did was just change this so rather than it being a list uh, it was displayed as like a bunch of checkboxes that I either checked or unchecked that way for now we can keep track of what we have and haven't done. So that's it for today like and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next video.